ladies and gentlemen. Hello. Oh, are we bursting people's ear bump? Ear bleh, bleh, ear bumps, no, eardrums? Maybe we can tweak it down a I little. I saw some red lining going shade. on. Yeah. Everyone's ears are bleeding. How's that? That looks alright. So, there we go. Hey, Bugsy, how are you? Yeah, and there should be no harping on me. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see the chat. Mm. All right, guys, uh, we are here today uh, in glorious Hamildale. Uh, we can tell Stardog hasn't been around recently. You've been missing some streams, Stardog. Yeah, you have indeed. Yeah. Someone's still uh, had to get uh, shaved off. Uh, it's it's growing back again, though, so that's all yeah. right. I just had to prove I had a chin under here. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah. A couple, actually. Yeah, so, yeah. As I say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All yeah. right, so anyway, we are... Um, Going to be looking for the elusive links today. We're looking for them at least. Let's yeah. see if we can get one now. Yeah. yeah, try and hunt them. <laughs> We're just going to be bird spotting today, actually. And, uh, yeah, yeah. going for a walk in the woods. So today I bought the recurve bow. I thought, let's try a recurve bow. Um, the 30 hour, which is not ethical for them, but I got the pistol, which is, uh, and an e caller and the usual doodacry. So basically, your game plan is to go with pistol or recurve. Pretty You're much. You're not making it easy of yourself, are you? No, that's no. it. Um, but, you know, I got this. It's all good. <laughs> so, I um, this is my live map. Um, so, I'm going to go to this little doodackery here. Is that way of you saying that you want to boost your hunter score on a paid time? Yeah, that's exactly what's <laughs> going on, actually. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I don't have a tree stand or anything, but my plan, actually, let's draw it on here, uh, is I am going to kind of zigzag down the gullies and come back up here like this. That's my plan, anyway. Um uh, as I see a lot of people on the forum have mentioned that they are uh, kind of on the west hand side of the map. So mm -hmm. um, I've also not bought my yellow glasses today so I can't be tempted to, uh, uh, you know, use them. Make the abuse them. Ab abuse them. It's the only way to wean myself off them mm -hmm. actually. So. Do, do, do. Found more reindeer looking for links. I did. I was looking for reindeer. <laughs> yeah, product sounds about right. Has anyone else been picking up any links yet though? You got any good ones? We have a really mixed like there's some people are like, No, I thought it'd be harder and then there's other people who are like messaging the support asking if they're actually in the map. <laughs> well that's uh, always gonna be a thing. I mean every time I get people commenting about things that like, Oh, they're not there It's like they're there. I mean meanwhile next door to you there's some guy who's got six of them by now. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> it's uh it's the way it goes. Yep. And uh yeah, I mean I think uh well I hope that especially a lot of the long term players are probably enjoying a bit more of a challenge in the animal. Mm -hmm. We can give you a wave. Dark Hunters, it works. It can't have sound. <laughs> is the German pointer useful for links? I see. Yes, I you can. See why not. Uh, I yeah. actually double check with Pat, and uh, it's supposed to be good as gold. Mm. Um, other road here, oh, heavier one. Row City. So I might actually just have a little bit of a spot and a well, a glass and a spot session. Uh, <laughs> Pixel went for a links yesterday. Had a nice walk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, maybe people just get lucky with them. Well, that's what we're trying now, just hoping to spot one out in the open. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, let's see if we can pick up on one. I mean, their colouring's pretty difficult to spot Yeah. as it is, so... Working yeah. as intended, so how, yeah. how nature designed them. That's it. I mean, uh, that's kind of the thing mm. that's a little bit uh, funny about it, is there was a guy, uh, Clem, who's put a good post in, uh, he was a trapper for years, him and his whole family, mm. and they never saw one in person, but caught a few in their traps. Yeah. And he said they're like super duper shy humans, and... Uh, I'm not surprised if you're going to try and trap them. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. But, um, you know, being out in the bush all the time trapping, you usually see all the animals around yeah. here, but... Well, it's at least going to stumble on them, yeah. That's guess. it. But you were at Skansen here in Sweden, weren't you? I day? was, yeah. yeah. Skansen, for those you don't know, is like an open-air um, museum, they call it. But it's it's a museum of, of Sweden. It has loads of old buildings and also has like a, a zoo area, let's say, with lots of Swedish species in there. They have links in there. Did you see the links? Uh, I had seen them last time, but they, yeah. were, they were hiding in their cave. Yeah, they do that. Yeah. yeah. And But there are some interesting uh, facts about them is they can take down a reindeer... Uh, usually the females will actually, and really? then feed the cubs. And it can take them four days to eat the whole reindeer. I'm so. not surprised because they're not they're not exactly huge little animals. No, they're not huge little animals. Um, no, huge animals. But like you know, you think like a reindeers. Yeah, like they're the pretty here. hefty creatures. <laughs> yeah, it's quite a good uh, yeah. takedown ratio. Well, I need to get up on this rock. Yeah, but like you said, I guess once they get them, it's going to keep them fed. So I'm surprised it was only four days, to be honest. I mean, yeah, that's it. Have you seen a unicorn though? 
Yes. I have seen a unicorn. I've seen unicorns, yeah. That's not a super big one. Mm, now you're making me hungry. Mmm, roe deer. Delicious roe. But you said you were possibly going out hunting for some roe. Oh, soon. hopefully. I have to get invited back, you see. Yeah. So maybe maybe I was not on my best behavior last time or something. Oh, uh, okay. I got some buddies with land. Maybe we could fix something. Yeah. <coughs> oh. Oh, that was a bit I think a bit there far might back. have been something else. Uh, I oh, sound like there was a couple of different things running away there. Was the status update wrong? It says a vehicle coming to Classic. No, it was right. Uh, We're going to talk to you uh, more about that next week. Yeah, think, we? yeah. There's a. I can't give too much away yet, but mm -hmm. uh, where is this blood gone? Stardog says they're rats oh, of the is. forest. They're really, really tasty rats, though. Yeah, I'd rather eat these rats over yeah. the rats, to be honest. Oh, so good. Up in the north of Sweden, when my uh, wife's parents were living. The postman he used to hunt, and he, you know he used to come by on the day. He's like, "Oh, I got something the other night or the other day, sorry," and uh, you'd get like a whole whole saddle of roe deer for like fifty bucks. Ooh. Nom. You know what? I'm thinking that. Oh, what? I don't have my sunglasses on. But you do. No. You do, and you don't. Maybe the game just loves knows. <laughs> it just knows you so well. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't think we should go after this Rodia. We're after Lynx, not Rodia. Terrible. Doc is going to be livid. Uh, that's it. Uh, so anyway, what were we talking about? Yeah, vehicle. There is a vehicle coming. And like I said, um, like our main aim is to make it balanced in the game. And to the point where... So it's a unicycle. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> but All about balance. We want to balance it to the point where if it's not your thing, it's not going to affect you at all. So in other words, if people... Uh, want to use it, that's good for them, but it's not going to affect anyone else in competitions and things no. like that. It's so. all about choice then, Dave. So you might not like it. That's fair enough. Don't use it. Yeah. Um, those of you who do like to use it, they can use exactly. it. Exactly. And uh, like you said, balance. It's about risk-reward. You might get some benefits in some direction, but it's going to penalize you in others. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. And uh, like you, even to the point where we've already talked about uh, like you know having an option for toggleable in multiplayer mm. uh, and uh, also limits within the multiplayer game as well so mm. um, it can't be eight vehicles driving around kind of thing driving around so you're saying it's got wheels oh well uh, we gave them the it's the a land vehicle we gave yeah. them uh, the wheelie hint yes uh, it was a really good hint really good it was so it was amazing so mm. um, yeah so uh, yeah I oh, mean, there will be more. Awesome. Was that down there? There was a road deer running away. Is there a road down there? Okay. It did look deer uh, right. Yeah, you yeah, see his butt in the trees there. Flying away. <laughs> no, Davey, it's uh, like, I mean, vehicles in general, in many forms, have been requested for a long time, actually, and they're pretty 50 50. Um, yeah. And it's Marmite. Some like them, some yeah, don't. That's right, Marmite or Vegemite. Vegemite for Marmite me. superior. Vegemite, so good. <laughs> yeah. Bicycle with sneaky wheels. Yeah. No, they, yeah, so like I was saying, is, um, at this stage, no one needs to be concerned or alarmed because the last thing we want to do is break the game balance in it. But, what we, you know, people have asked for a mode of transport for a long time, and that is what we are mm -hmm. after. But anyway. Links. <laughs> Segways are also very quiet anyway, so they yes. don't bother people too much. Yeah, well, there was uh, someone put a, a post up about hoverboards yeah. and, uh, <laughs> in the forum and wanting to be able to shoot from them as well. So. Oh, man. Where am I going? Am I going the right way? I'm going ish the right way. So I'm hoping to find some links footprints and then kind of go from there, really. Unless we're lucky enough to get a call. Um. Mm -hmm. Meow. Meow. No. Yeah. Here, push, 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 push. <laughs> Break out the can oh, of what tuna. What does it have here? It's kss, 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 kss. Which Oh, that's a, yeah, that's the Swedish that's cat. Swedish cat, but if you go yeah. kss, kss to a dog in New Zealand, it gets riled, riled up. <laughs> it's going to uh, chew your nose off. Yeah, pretty much. Uh. Get him, kss, kss, kss. <laughs> So, yeah, interesting. Well, tanks, want some tanks? Mm. Fish <laughs> tanks for the hunting lodge. Yeah, that'd be nice. People want to fishing? Gave them fish in a tank. 
Oh dear. Missed your map starting point. You were just straight from the launch at me today. Uh, yeah, so I yeah. just, uh, I mean, this is, like I said, this is just my map um, here, yeah. and I've gone up to here, uh, and my aim is, I'm going to start walking down this uh, ridge here, uh, but I'm trying to get away from that road deer, because uh, if I just keep heading down there, it's going to keep spooking everything mm. in the general vicinity. Uh, and truth be told, I actually do not know where the links are in this. I purposely don't ask some things, so it doesn't, uh, or it seems more genuine. Yeah. So I've seen uh, there's some nice ones. I think but if bugs, you've got the highest uh, scoring links at the moment. I think don't you on the leaderboard? So why not keep it Swedish with a new vehicle How being a KTM dirt bike or, or a Koenigsegg? That would work as well. I didn't know that <laughs> KTM was Swedish actually. Yeah, I was KTM Swedish. I know Husqvarna obviously yeah, is Swedish. Yeah, Husqvarna is. But, yeah. um, KTM. Or I think KTM was Dutch, as we say down south. Husqvarna. Uh, uh, that makes Swedish people. If yeah, the vehicle gets added, I'll not be renewing my membership. That's unfortunate, Davey. But uh, like we said, I mean, it, it doesn't affect you in any way if it's in the game. Yeah, um, that's that's the thing I do not understand. No. Is like, why are you... But that's your choice, up to you. No, um, definitely. But I'm it's sure. like kind of cutting your nose off to spite your face a little bit. Mm. Uh, as like we said, is whenever it goes out, it's not going to affect anybody else apart from the person that has a vehicle. So, yeah. Um, yeah. And it's not like people are going to be driving across the reserves firing out the windows no. <laughs> no I mean maybe we should take the 50 millimeter Gatling gun off the top yeah maybe that, that might cause maybe we should get rid of that yeah yeah. So. Ah, Go got themselves a grouse on Tuesday I saw oh, black nice. grouse I was like is that a new a famous grouse got a new brand <laughs> out <laughs> <laughs> it's the premium edition uh, triple distilled oh god you have to do a lot to famous grouse to make it drinkable yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh. I, I thought about that, Ron, when I saw you come in and say hi all on the Tegucio account. And yes, hello, Ron. <laughs> Which did Ron log in on something else, did he? Yeah, or Tegucio. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, I guess, yeah. That's uh, Ron's driving persona. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he does a lot of driving simulator games. Alter well. ego. That's it. Grouse is grouse, mate. Wait, does anyone else but Australians and New Zealanders use grouse as good? Something's good? Oh, he said, man, that's grouse. Not my neck of the woods, at least. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Do you have grouse in? No, I don't think so. <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> Just thought it was a good word we yeah. use it. That's it. Yeah. Where are you, Lynx? And by the way, guys, there's a competition in the forums, which is under the help one. So uh, first person to shoot a rear um, bobcat gets 1,000 EMs. Bobcat? I mean, links. <laughs> links, thank you for the correction. Uh -huh. And uh, anybody that can film their new annual behavior gets 2,000. So there's mm. actually some new... Uh, there's some pretty cool stuff you can see that I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Um, but uh, obviously, uh, it's all kind of quite rare, so yeah, that's good. Uh, hello, Angdelem and Spawn Anubis. Welcome to the stream, folks. Hey, Spawn Anubis, how are you, buddy? Ah, oh, Ron said he's actually just spotted and been recording a link, so maybe he might actually spot some of that uh, behavior. Yeah. <coughs> I mean, I guess, uh, you know, like... Heading around slowly is probably pretty keen. A uh, key, I would say. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, it's you either wander around slowly and hope to come across something, or you could go hell for leather and try and get some tracks and go slow from there. I yeah, guess it's, uh, true, true. I think uh, maybe two, 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 three would be nice, or two, four, three on this map now. Yeah, I mean, you're gonna have a good selection to use it on now. So yeah. So Ron says he's been stand hunting them actually. So that's well, I was interested to see actually how they would do with stand hunting on the links because uh, being that, that they are few and far between, uh, hoping they come within range of your setup. But uh, let us know if people had success with that. It'd be interesting to hear. 
Yeah, I, um, I mean, because a lot of it we don't really know until it's out in the wild, and we've got hundreds of people, thousands of people playing the game. Um, that's it. How things perform exactly? We know how we, what we think they're going to perform, but uh, yes. Yeah, I mean, in the uh, preview stream, I just sat in a tree stand, <laughs> and actually nothing came in. And then I went for a walk and got a call and managed to get one in. So Dave says, "Can we have zip lines and cave diving and spear fishing? Would you like them in the game?" I mean. <laughs> Probably those things are not really applicable to a hunting game so much. Uh, Maybe. Spear fishing? Maybe. I think he's just setting you up for him to say, and vehicles aren't such a thing in a hunting game either. I don't know. How, how did you get to your last hunt? Me? Yeah. Mm, I flew, actually. Got yeah. <laughs> teleporting and stuff. Yeah. I mean, it's... Um, yeah, I mean, people do use vehicles for hunting. Yes, so. they do. I mean, the way that we want to use them in the game, though, of course, isn't that you, you know, drive up to a spot, hop out, and start firing. That's not going to be something that you're going to be able to do. Um, you will have to use them intelligently, let's say. Mm -hmm. See? I can read you, Davey. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, yeah, so... Uh, I don't know if everyone's okay. talking about the ptarmigans, but uh, they were missing the uh, lynx ate all they the ptarmigans. They were taking a, a break. Yeah, and mm. so after reports on the... Well, some good reports, actually, in the forum that there were no ptarmigan, we had a look at them, and uh, we could confirm that there were no ptarmigan at all in the map. That's, you know, that's game development for you folks. You do some changes that have nothing to do with something. And uh, I thought I saw something there. Yeah, and then you have unintended effects on something entirely different. <laughs> yeah, I mean... So this is why I have to test and test and test so hard like we do. But yeah. sometimes things can slip through. And uh, it's such a double-edged sword because some people would have been going, Yay, there's no ptarmigans anymore! And then we put them back in, obviously. And uh... We have confirmed that the, the vehicle does have wheels. We haven't had so ma had so many haven't said so how many. <laughs> God, I need to have forgotten how to English. Yeah. Um, you yeah. haven't said how many wheels or what orientation the wheels are in. Uh, yeah. There are time against now. Um, apologies for that because I know some people aren't necessarily fans of them either. Yeah. But uh, for those who do like time against, they're back. Uh, as they were intended to be. That's right, yeah. Uh, if you uh, you would have had nearly a good 24 hours with no time against. Yeah, enjoy the peace. That's right. No, no that was our around. secret event we put on for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, you wouldn't be able to see a Lynx there if you tried, I don't think. I already uh, suggested a, a unicycle there, Ron. Matt was talking about balance, and I said it's nothing more important than balance than if you get a <laughs> unicycle, so... What's this track? We're going to use the mini game for the climbing to to get around on it. <laughs> 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 Look, there's Tarmigans. There we go. Proof. Proof. So, yeah. yeah the Lynx have stopped eating them all That's now. right, they're full. Yeah. So. Hey, Lynn, how are you? I imagine Tarmigans are the best with dipping sauce. Yeah. Um, so, uh, Len, you might have missed it. There were actually no ptarmigans for the last 24 hours on this map, so you missed your chance. Len's famous for shooting them with the biggest caliber gun again. <laughs> so. I reckon ptarmigan would be nice to eat. I don't think I've tried them. I've had quail, um, but not ptarmigans. I, I have no idea... I don't know what they'd be like. I imagine like if you deep fried them so they're real crispy and you just ate it all, oh, that'd be good. Anything's good when it's been deep fried and this crispy. Is, this <laughs> is true, actually. <laughs> this is true. So, Ron, Davey's saying, he's, on a serious note, you'd like to see what you add to be water safe as well to help in retrieving some things which are not always possible due to water. What I mean, is ideally, not? we'd rather fix it so the water allowed you to retrieve Well, actually, I'm just going to ask what is not because we've figured out uh, wave mechanics in the game where everything gets. <gasps> oh! That was a lucky spot right there. Look at that, you can't even see it. Yeah. Until you go. Dun, 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 dun. Wait, I and it's gone oh, again. Oh, there it is, there, look. Oh, wow. That's a nice one. It's got like yeah. a white collar on it. Yeah. Female. Well, let me. Uh, I'll just double check. I've got my uh, sense brain on actually. 
Still working. Fifteen, sixteen minutes left. Yep. So, and put this one in here. All right, guys. Have you heard this call here? Uh, do I want to recurve it? No, I don't want to recurve it. I'm just going to. So you push B is the uh, the default tech key. Slide your mouse up and listen to it. Does it do requests? It does. You got any Metallica? <laughs> no. <laughs> Cats like Metallica. It looks like the BFG 9000. For those of you who don't know, there's a, a gun from uh, Doom. Oh, it does actually, yeah. <laughs> so, there we go. Now, the 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 chal the part of Matt that likes a challenge wants to recurve this thing. But the well, let's, let's, let's get a better shot than you did on that road deer at the start. Yeah, <laughs> that's I mean that's the other thing is I've been shooting terribly lately actually, so how far away was it Lynx? Like hundred meters, so I like the uh the different sound effects. It's kind of a bit mm. nicer than the the bobcat uh the bobcat mouse squeal. Okay, so is animal interaction the lynx making reindeer uneasy, or is it not yet, um, no, not yet known by the community? I mean, the lynx is a predator, so other species will react to it if there is a lynx in the area. So that could be a good hint, actually, if you're spying some animals who are avoiding particular areas. That could be a hint that maybe you want to go check out a lynx in the neighborhood. Yeah, I mean, the thing that will be a little bit hard about that is having a lynx and a reindeer in the same location to see it would be... Uh, but that that is actually not the uh, the animation. No, you'll know it when you see it. Yeah. <laughs> Will the vehicle be limited to set reserves? Is it amphibious? You're not going to get anything out of us today. No, you'll hear you'll hear more about it next week. Um. Where is this thing? Is it coming in? There it is. Ah, uh, yeah. Nope. How far away is it? Let's see what the... Uh, oh, I can get it in using the... Uh, the doodacery caller. That's what it's called. Oh, I didn't bring the new uh, Lynx scent spray. What a noob. Yeah, there's also a scent spray you guys can use. <laughs> I was thinking, how can you have Lynx and not have a spray? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, classic. <laughs> and Ned Bella says it raises onto its back leg and tap darts the Charleston. Yeah, that's it. You win. <laughs> Come on. I mean, obviously, uh, bringing a rifle probably would have been a good idea for this, mm -hmm. but... Uh, Went straight into hard mode. Hey, at least we found a lynx, though. I'm yeah, we found I'm, one. I'm, I'm, yep. I'm uh, impressed. I am pretty impressed, actually. Surprised. We're in the first 20 minutes that we've spotted one. Yeah. I don't know if... Um, oh, well, yeah, that might have been one of the first streams you did. Was it the Bobcat stream? Yeah. yeah and I remember I Pat's what? Pat's good shooting on that. It was crazy. You managed to nail that one on the run. On the run, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Do the lynx run if they spot the caller? I don't believe the caller itself has any kind of aggro. Uh, uh, well, actually, the for the bobcat, it does. I'm not sure with the yeah, lynx, because yeah. the bobcat come in and they go, hang on a second, this is not a dead mouse. This is not, oh, yeah. <laughs> or a dying mouse, and then they all take mm. off. But you know saying pistol distance if you're a good shot? You reckon at 95? Oh, I don't know. There's probably going to be another one coming in now. Yeah, there's one behind you. Just sat over your shoulder. Yeah. I mean, look how hard that is to see. Yeah. Come on. You know you want to. I mean, there's a chance it's actually, it could be a little spooked or something too. Mm. And it's just waiting. Still slinking in the opposite direction. It is. Slink back my way. There it is, through the trees there. Is it coming? No, it's still going. Across still here. going away. 
Yes. Uh, Bert, yes, indeed, the vehicle we're talking about is for classic, specifically. There's a beer over there, too. Mm. Looking at the beer while the Lynx is running in. That says the links look amazing. Thumbs up to the devs. Thank you very much. Is the 308 ethical? I don't think the 308 is ethical. I don't think no, so. It sounds no. a bit too much. Too much gun. It's in there somewhere. that enough on the TV. Is that where I get it from? Is yeah. It? Oh, awful adverts. Yeah. <laughs> there is lots of bad adverts over here. And they're all for casinos. All of them. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> I won't sing the rest of that one. No, right, go. No, it cannot be more specific. No kappa. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Maybe if I see this thing, I just shoot it. That's kind of the point of the game. Yeah, but I'm, you know, like <laughs> not wait for it to come in, is what I mean. Yeah, I get you. I mean, you know, how close will they come in as well is the other issue before they uh, skedaddle. Yeah, I mean, I know they, they did do. Did you put your, your armpit occluding I spray did. on? I yeah. did. I can't even see it anymore. Uh, they are really, really tricky to spot. Yep. Where is it, guys? Maybe it's already done the runner. It was kind of that way-ish. Yeah. I mean, it seemed pretty, pretty chill. You haven't done anything crazy that should. No, but it, I mean, they might yeah. spot me too. They've got really, yeah, pretty good eyesight. It's true. No, not real close to me. It's like playing Wells Waldo here, I'm like staring around at pixels. Yeah. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that was the links. Yeah. <laughs> it's been uh, it's been a good things. Yeah. Next time, Matt will bring a proper gun. That's right. <laughs> I didn't expect it. Uh, to not come into the call? Yeah. See any movement? That's what I'm looking for, yeah. I think the stream's ever seen us so concentrated. Yeah, they're like... <gasps> They're releasing links into the wild in England. Why would they do that? <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. <clears throat> well, I don't know. The English released all sorts of stuff all over the other countries. So that is true. But I like to think we learned learned a lesson at that point. Now, <laughs> um, yeah. Let's add cats to defeat these rabbits. Yeah. Good idea. Well. This is uh, turning out to be as hard as I thought they probably would be. Mm -hmm. I should have brought the e caller with me. Wait, was it some movement? I thought I saw some here. But I don't. Mm. I don't really want to go too crazy on it. Mm. 
Where are you, Lynx? Uh, hey, Nor, about vehicles. You know, we've already talked about having flags so that they can be disabled in multiplayer games, if you so wish, so that won't be a problem. That's right. We understand that, yeah, that would be a thing otherwise. <laughs> no, we... Do we think it's gone, or...? I don't know. I th I think patience... You reckon some more patience a, here? Yeah. Okay. Either that or you do get your head in the dirt and just crawl down and hope to find some tracks and see what's yeah, going let's on. Yeah, see what these ones are. Come on, Lynx. See, introducing Lynx in Scotland, I think, sounds even odder still, because they already have the wildcats in Scotland, which are very, very rare. I can imagine that Lynx would only add uh, an element of competition that they wouldn't be able to cope with. But I don't think these will be the bobcat tricks. Unless it's been doing some circle work. <coughs> Oh, uh, oh it was fleeing. There we, go. there we go. So it actually was in a spooked state. Um, so maybe that actually... That explains why it wasn't coming in for the call. Yeah, though. exactly. And I think, uh, I mean, obviously I didn't bring it, but uh, I should have brought the e-caller down with me. Hopefully it's still in the area somewhere. Mm. Hey, B, now I think the reason they're introducing them is probably because they used to be uh, a native species, but, you know, the problem is that it's all well and good, but uh, the ecosystem has changed since then. So it's, uh, yeah, I'm sure they know what they're doing, I guess. Maybe this lynx has gone... I mean, at least if it's spooked once and it's alert now, I think crawling into it, it's not yes. going to be an option, is it? Not really, no. This is where you pop up your stand, whip out a thermos and wait. <laughs> yeah. I should have just... Does Lynx react to the skin auto lure for Fox and Bobcat? That's a good question. I don't... I haven't heard any talk of that. I'm not sure, actually. Yeah, the decoys. Mm. I don't think the bobcat do, so mm. probably not. Alright, I think I'm going to uh, have to write this one off. And be on our merry way. Unfortunately. Mm. Ugh, if only you'd had the rifle. Yes. Or taken the shot. You had a scope on, you had a pistol scope on the thing, didn't you? But yeah, the uh, 357's not super punchy yet. Mm. But you can never get the shots you don't take. That's right. I don't, I've kind of even lost uh, its original location mm. now. But anyway. Now you get to play the Find Your E-Caller minigame. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, here somewhere. There it is. I see it. Yeah. Yep. Oh, wow. Yeah, Matt does. He has the, the first lady. I do. Lady and the Tramp. <laughs> yep, that makes sense. <laughs> right, let's turn that off and uh, pick her up. Do you have to turn it off before picking it up? Uh, probably not. It's not going to carry on chirping away in your bag. Uh, yeah, it might do. Maybe have just a walking decoy then. That would be pretty handy, wouldn't it? Yeah. 
Yeah, I think I think the pistol would have been good enough, yes, to kill it, but I guess hitting it would have been the, the challenge. But <laughs> we can uh, have a crack next time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good advice from Pappy again there with your e callers. Put a flag on it. That's uh, what I used pretty quick with the when we first introduced it with the bobcat. A very good idea. Well, I was go oh, I thought I was going pretty mm. slow, but uh yeah, well, as we saw though, it already fled once, so I guess it was uh it was spooky. Yeah, your scent eliminator has worn off. All right, let's uh put some more back in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but uh anyway, so yeah, if, if I don't, I just bought a uh better rifle. We would have bagged ourselves a bobcat then. A lynx rather, mm -hmm. cheapers. Why did we bring along the thirty thirty? Was it a thirty thirty? Thirty yeah. Thirty up. Um I am I am questioning that myself now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not quite sure. I didn't know if you had a plan B or something else you wanted to get whilst we're out here. No, no, right. well I do like to uh, dress for all occasions, mm -hmm. but uh not the best of ideas. I have to get my bobcat tracking skills up too, actually. Yeah. That's not a bobcat. Nope. Alright, let's head back down this ridge anyway. Go down here. Hopefully find... Uh, he was heading that direction. Yeah. So there we go. So, what is the chat up to? Bert Merlin shot a diamond bunny in the butt. Nice. Hmm? <laughs> So Bino, he's taking it slowly and carefully. He's getting his setup down first before actually doing any hunting. So he's uh, getting his stands all in place. Very nice. Hello, Paddle Poppinator. Welcome to the stream. Hey, how are you? So, uh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Got the Lynx call. So it's calmed down, and I think it was still there, actually. Uh, which is uh, interesting. Uh, let's have another crack at this. Was that a Lynx call that came in yeah, as well? Yeah, oh, it was. Yeah. I was busy reading the chat. Alright. Uh, make sure you got the right call on. Mm hmm. And uh, it's going to come in from over this way somewhere. So yeah, I think the bobcat was still there, but... Oh look, there it is. It's actually walking the right direction. Yeah. Oh, you got the uh, the breath coming out. That's quite a good little... Uh, yeah. ...sight. I don't think I bought the good scop uh, scope. The spot scope. The spotting scope. Should have bought the, uh, mm. the newer one. Did we think about wildlife cameras? I thought trail cameras would be a pretty cool addition to the game, actually. Yeah, I, neat. I think it'd be cool. Pat likes that idea, too. Mm. Was it Pat that suggested it? Mm? <laughs> or maybe Patrick. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oop. So I guess uh, a little bit of patience did pay off there. I'm not going too crazy. Not that it's actually come in yet, but... Uh... Oh, actually, Host and Fury are saying they spotted a lynx on their trail camera uh, last winter, in fact. Oh, wow. Where is it going? <clears throat> it's 
already buying those trees. Yeah, and taking it quite slowly. And that blob of tree matter. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm hmm. I was looking at the wrong wrong uh, area. This is two there, but. Is it just crawled underground? No, there's a little, there's a little <laughs> lip here. A little it's a, a, a burrowing lynx. That's it, after those mice. Snow mice. Hello to Deutsche Pony, what's up? We're on the hunt for lynx, is what's up. Somewhere. We had one, but now he's uh, yeah, behind, turned into a mole. Behind a little crest. Yeah. Just got your first links before, Paddle Pomerina, nice. Come on. <coughs> KJack has followed, thank you very much for uh, the follow, most appreciated. Come on, Linksy. Where are you? <coughs> New vehicle was a Lynx helicopter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, do I hear something? Balan says burrowing Lynx wouldn't surprise me as I saw a submerged white tail uh, yesterday. Hmm. I feel like I hear something. That would be an equaler. Uh, fo footprints. Is this cat gone again? in chat there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can hear... Oh, it's the... Tom again? <coughs> Where has the slinx gone? There it there is. There it is. Patience, young it man. Slowly. Look at that. Mm. Look at the ear. Oh, was it? it's not looking at me, is it? No. All right. Let's see what it looks like through the uh, the scope. Let's wait for it to get in a little bit closer. Or should I just pull the trigger, Graham? Well, be no sand. Shoot it on sight. All right, shoot it on site. This is Beano's uh, mess if we must. Nope, oh, that Easy. looked like it, the job to me. <laughs> this is what we could have done 15 minutes ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I really feel like I just heard something else flee too. I think there might have been two in the area, maybe. Mm. Uh, 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 uh. Get this all ready before. Oh, it's already there. Good. Of course, it's in my hand. Yay, links down. Uh, it is indeed a first lady that he was using. That is indeed. Yeah. Nice. Beautiful. So, let's have a... Uh, well, actually, it's not called the wild, so we can pick it up and have a good look at it. The fur looks amazing on it. 14.2 kg female, 6.1 trophy score. Right lung. Very nice. It was only 45 metres, that one, actually. And there we go, my first links on the, the uh, my live account. So let's uh, have a really nice little look at this. Fur detail, and it's mm. nice. It looks like it might be a little bit nicer than the bobcat, potentially. But, uh, yeah, some really nice coloration in it. Ooh, if I can get the camera to work. And the, uh, what are they, oh, there must be like a, a proper term for the whiskers on top of the ears. 
I'd, I'd like to know what they uh, what it's called. All right, let's get a uh, tufts. Let's get a, uh, a trophy shot, huh? Should we? No, that one's not very good. Let's go solemn, maybe. I quite like uh, this one, and then you can make the kitty cat go in your lap. <laughs> Uh, the blue felt kind of thing. Uh, yeah. Been inspecting you, Mr. Bot. Are there any uniques with the links? Yes. Mm. Rears. Um, that's actually one of the competitions at the moment. Oh, can't even see its arm. Oh, it's been too much time doing this trophy shot. But uh, yeah, there are rear variations. Uh, as per usual, we don't tell you what they are until people start getting yeah, them. Exactly. There's uh, no fun if we already uh, spill the beans. All right, that'll do. <laughs> That's a very undignified trophy shot if ever I saw one. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting on top of the cat. Yeah, teabagging your kill. Jose <laughs> <laughs> hey, Fierce says, oh, great, now we're teabagging the links. Yeah. Yep. Anyway, links down. First one. So uh, thanks to some of the people in uh, the forum. I say they get them up in this uh, northwest area. And... It looks to be oh I'm running. It looks to be true so far. Mm -hmm. Are we going to fix the buckshot for the call of the wild? That's something that I have reported to the team, and uh, Zeke, our game designer, is talking with uh, our other game designer, Rannick, about that. So it's being looked at. Yes, don't worry. Um, yeah, Matt and the cat. Ear tufts. The mat sat on the cat. Yeah, we needed. I should get a shooting mat, and then it's a cat and the mat on the mat. Yeah. Planet Earth will be calling you about sitting on links. <laughs> Thankfully, it was already dead at this point, so. Uh. Well, are you telling me you can't ride links in real life? You have to tape a few together. Mm. Aha, okay. Two cat power. Actually, no, you can't use tape. I've seen what happens when you put a piece of tape on the side <laughs> of the cat. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Maybe, the that, maybe that's how you steer them. Yeah. Supply it to the left and right accordingly. Yeah. How far have we got over there? Two seventy. Jeez, far. But anyway, we have a links. Yay! Yay! Good times. Let's have a look and see what uh, what else we can pull up. This valley is sometimes quite good for reindeer, roe deer, fox, and the odd bear actually as well. So we another footprint. What is it? It is reindeer fleeing. A solo female one, I think. Mm. Oh, there's one there. Yeah. Anyway, we're not after reindeer. So, here's a little good spot. Let's see if we can, uh, maybe we can find another one. You're pushing your luck in ten minutes, mate. Finding it for this, you mean another links? Yeah. You never know. You never know. Trying to be a little optimistic. Thanks for dropping by, Ron. Enjoy your recording, whatever it is today. Oh, no, he was doing links, wasn't he? So, yeah. yeah, he was. All right, let's go up. Uh, okay, and who cares? Has been updating the wiki. Yeah, Good he has indeed. Let's have a look. Let's have up in this pocket in the last ten minutes. Let's see what we can come across, if anything. All right, footprint. And it is hey, a lynx. There we go. <laughs> You're the jammiest guy on the planet. <laughs> Seriously, I, I, I joke, but it is so true. Here's one I prepared earlier. Uh, Good times. Maybe, maybe we can get a. Uh, it'd be nice to get a male one just to complete the set. Mm. Maybe I should just put the. Let's plop down your corner and see what happens. But that's that's always dodgy because you never know which idea they, which way they're coming from. And if you're less you're in a stand. It's yeah. Uh, Yeah, the wise words there from uh, Lomolp. Maybe you should have got a rifle on the way. 
Yeah. But pistol did the job. It did. Mm. All right. You know what? We know it's in that direction. What's up? Oh, it's a rock. <laughs> it's the elusive rock. Yeah. Right. Now we just sit here and wait. And let's see uh, if we're lucky enough to get anything. Come on, run in. There we go. <laughs> Peter watched the last Lynx video and noticed there was a gold pot in the shed at the starting lodge. Were you on the beta by any chance? We were, yeah. Yeah, the beta has all kinds of collectibles from all of our events uh, scattered around it, so that's why you spotted that one. Yeah. It won't be there on uh, your clients, or at least it shouldn't be. Until next St. Paddy's Day, Indeed. if we decide to use them again. I mean... Could take 10 minutes for this links to even come in. Mm. The other one came in very slowly. It did. But then again, that one had already been spooked once, so it was probably taking it easy. Oh, uh, yeah. There is no dev magic on this stream, Hosen Fiora. This is all uh, live and uh, off the fly. It's nothing but raw fly. talent and skill. Yeah. And 90% luck. Blind luck, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Come on, where are you? Hey, kitty, kitty, kitty. It's probably just behind this uh, tree here. Woo! It's definitely a very angry sounding cat anyway. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> David says, we've seen Graham on the phone sending in orders. Uh, for pizza. No, after the stream. No. Oh, don't talk about pizza. No, I want pizza. Oh, that's a great idea. Oh. Damn it. I'm going to go and pick up some paint to, clear, to paint our floor at home on the after work. It's right next to McDonald's. And I'm hungry. It's dangerous. Very dangerous. I haven't eaten there in about six months, so I'm trying to keep the streak going. Burger King, though. Oh, so good. Do you guys in America and Burger King have the Big King XXL? And for you, I uh, guess they Pino, have the that's King it's XXL. called Hungry Jacks in Australia. Is it? Burger King is, yeah. So. Well, Burger King is called Hungry Jacks. It is, yeah. I mean, the story goes that there was already a guy over there with a burger restaurant called Burger King, and mm -hmm. he wouldn't. Uh, you can only have one king. That's it would have right. been a civil war, and it gets messy. And that's yeah. right. Yeah. Do you mean the double whopper? No, it's not the double whopper. No. It's so three patties. Isn't it, the yeah. Thing, so. Well, they. I, I I call Thin it. Ones. It's like the Big Mac of uh, of Burger King. But it's actually big. Yeah, it's actually big, and it's got like kind of that secret saucy stuff to it. It's mm. really good. Oh man, you're making me hungry now. Oh man, um, yes, I'm starving. Where are you? Oh, 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 is that? No. Hey, kitty, kitty, kitty. What we should do is set up a Christmas tree. That always attracted my cat. <laughs> so, yeah. Pull all the lights off. Well, you, you walk into the living room and you'd see the tree going like this. And like, what? Okay, the cat's up in the Christmas tree again. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> so. Are we getting lucky? Five minutes left for this cat mm. to show up. And then we're going to go get burgers. <laughs> <sighs> if I get burgers, I'll get... I won't be allowed in the house tonight. No. Where are you? 
how old those tracks were either. It could have been halfway across the reserve. It by could now, have been, so yeah, definitely. Didn't didn't get that poop. I'm kind of hoping that they uh, roam in an area or something. But Davey's asking, why would you not be allowed in the house if you get burgers? I think it's due to the frequency of burger consumption. Yeah. yeah. There's uh, <laughs> been a few burgers. Uh, uh, but the other thing too is you, you will have a nice dinner mm. made probably when I get home. So obviously... Uh, Lucky you. I've got to make it when I get back. Oh, yeah. If Cooking I turn, lasagna for the wife. If I turn up like, nah, 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 I'm full. I can't eat it. She's probably going you know, to stab me a few times. I'd that say. sounds understandable. Yeah, because uh, she puts a lot of nice effort into her cooking, and I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Hopefully she's watching this and making brownie points. I, I noticed that going off yeah, there. That was, yeah, uh, yeah. That's right. She sometimes does watch. Can't be a good Aussie burger though, with beetroot in it. I yeah. was I was a bit weirded out by that at first until I tried one. I was like, it's this is eh? a good idea. Yeah, yeah. that's really good. And it's you know, actually a Aussie barbecue truck that comes to Stockholm is during it? the winter. They have an Aussie grill and they make bar barbecues, with a, barbecues, a, a burgers Australia. on the barbecue with beetroot. Why do they turn up in winter? That's not grill season. No, but they have a winter market. It's like an international marketplace. Oh, so actually, they have like an English store. And but that. technically, it's actually. Australian it is barbecue. Australian's barbecue season. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's only one thing better than an Australian burger, and it's a Kiwi burger. So. There you go. Belton says, almost every Hunter stream players are doing their own calls. Doesn't leave you a feature idea. Scrap the callers, make, a make us do our own sounds through the mic. I've joked about that before. That'd be awesome. It would be cool. <laughs> we actually, like, you know, we like Guitar Hero. We'd give you one of these as a peripheral, and you'd have to actually, like, you know, honk down your <laughs> microphone. And, uh, <laughs> That would be awesome. I wonder how many burgers you can make from a Cape Buffalo. I'd say more than 10. Oh, I just, yeah. Mm. That'd be amazing. Kangaroo burgers are riot. We actually had a, a phase in England when we were in the, in the middle of the whole mad cow disease crisis where kangaroo meat started appearing on the shelves in our local Tesco's. Yeah, okay. Ostrich as well, that kind of thing. Yeah. Well, the kangaroo is delicious. I like it with some mushroom sauce. Mm. It's good. Hello, Ormi Gaming. Welcome to the stream. Unfortunately, a little bit late. We're going to be wrapping up in just a couple of minutes. Yeah, a couple um, of minutes time, but yeah. I mean, you know, to recap, we've poorly shot a road here to start with. Rue is very lean, but you know saying? Yeah, I've seen them. They are ripped. I mean... <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, if you cook them too fast, it goes pretty leathery. Mm. Uh, we managed to s like spot a lynx actually by walking around, and then uh, we had to wait for it to calm down, mm. but it did, and then we managed to call it in, and we shot it. Oh, Jack in the Box used to serve roux burgers in USA, in fact. Ah. Well, I never. Roux smells strongly. <laughs> yes, it does indeed. Really? Mm-hmm. It's like a gamey kind of smell? Yeah, or, yeah. some of them are like... Kind of urine smelling. Oh, you mean the actual animal? I thought we were referring to the meat. Oh, uh, well, yeah, yeah, I don't know. I know goat can sometimes, meat can smell sometimes like bad. Yeah. Is there a moose lying down or a bear? Just a bear. bear. Yeah. He's barely there. He's having a snooze, though. Mm hmm. Just, just freshly dined on the links. Sleepy time for Mr. Bear. Okay, the meat when it's cooking smells. Mm. Well, it looks like our gamble to sit down and call them in hasn't paid off. No. But, uh... Oh, well. We got one. That was more, that was one more than I thought we might get. That's so, right. So, uh, we're good. And, uh, you know... That's the thing about these streams, you know, we want to show off new animals and we have the same odds of finding them as everyone else out there, unless we're obviously doing a very early beta show, Yes. In which case we can maybe steer things in our favour, yeah. but on live we can't do any of that shenanigans. So. No. Uh, Alrighty. Well. Cool. It is that time, ladies and gents. Mm. Thank you very much for joining, and uh, let us know on the forums how your lynx hunting's going yourself. And as Matt said, we have competitions up now for the first one to spot a rare, and the first one to spot some of the special well, lynx behaviors. First one to shoot a rare. 
Okay, shoot her ass. Right, First one to spot the behavior. We're gonna, like, that's the one. You know, yeah. the people will call us out on the fine print. So. Well, they can read that on the forums. So. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's <laughs> the true. contract is there. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. So. Hey, but uh, have a really good weekend, everyone. Um, mm-hmm. Good luck with the links, and uh, we will see you next week. Yes, we will do. And uh, Tuesday for Call the Wilder Calls, don't forget. That's so, right. Uh, yeah. Yes. Alrighty. Catch Cheerio. you later, everyone. Bye. Bye-bye.